time at the El Royale? You have the option to stay in either California or Nevada. I always want to stay in the honeymoon suite, even though I'm not currently on my honeymoon. <laughs> what are you doing out here? I got a job singing in Reno tomorrow. Don't pay nothing, but uh, singing, singing. <laughs> this is not a place for a priest, Father. You shouldn't be here. It's a little too quiet in here. It gives me the willies. Sir? Can't take my eyes off you. We have a problem. You'd be like heaven to you watch me? I only watch who they tell me to watch. Who's they? Management. Did you think you could just take what's mine? I wouldn't come a hunt. No, I figured you would. But I'd be ready when he did. Are you lost, Father? Can I confess something to you? I'm not really a priest. It's a game. It all starts with a simple choice. Would you mind opening the door? No, I ain't gonna do that. Which side are you on? Right, wrong, God or no God? Red or black? I've done horrible things. So does everybody. Shit happens. Get the whiskey. whether the program's worth the cost Seven. in money and in lives. Six. Five. What are the chances you're not coming back? Four. Those kids, they don't have a father anymore. Three. So you're going to sit the boys down? Two. And you're going to prepare them for the fact you might not ever come home. One. Do you think you're coming back? serious problems. We've got this under control. You're a bunch of boys. You don't have anything under control. Let me guess, he's done something crazy. Shove me again, I wanna break your neck. Welcome to the Looney Bus. McKenna. Nebraska Williams. That's Coyle. That's Lynch. With Murphs. Why are you here? I don't think you believe me. Come on, man. I had a run in with a space alien. This fucking guy is crazier than the rest of us. <laughs> the fuck was that? That's the thing that killed my men.
Alien. Guess who's back? It ain't a fucking question. Can't go and live by when the presence of a living legend. Predators. They exploit weakness. Tracks its prey. Like a game. Seems to enjoy it. That's not a predator, that's a sports hunter. Well, we took a vote. Predator's cooler, right? Fuck yeah. Do you have a plan? Ex-sniper with PTSD and a team that's mental? You're insane, right? Yeah! Gentlemen, they're large, they're fast, and fucking you up's their idea of tourism. Figured something out, I think we're gonna die. Just pointing it out. My big boy's a hunter. He brought his dogs with him. September 14th. I'm not sure I've ever met a man quite like you. You haven't. We have a problem. Good. Virtual reality. It's completely immersive and some people lose track of their surroundings. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Can I just ask, what is wrong with you? Ow. Did you or did you not burn the Côte du Roc restaurant to the ground? Um... And did you fire a missile at a peloton of French cyclists? Well... Before commandeering an open-top bus and tossing the tour guide off the top deck? The youngest candidate, Hart spoke at full campaign trail. The clear front runner. So start with the uh, shoulder in a little. My name is Gary Hart, and I'm running for president. I want you to think about the opportunity that we have right here, right now. I've never known a guy more talented at untangling politics so that anyone can understand. It is a gift, and he wants to share that. And all anybody wants is for him to take a stupid photo. He will never understand that. Gary Hart is the man to beat in 88. If we hold ourselves to those highest standards, then the voters cannot do otherwise. Senator, I want to ask you some questions about the woman in your townhouse. Can you tell us how you know her? You can't be serious. No one is staying in my home. There's no need for that. Uh, I, I am serious, sir. Oh, cinnamon, where are you going to run to? The one thing I asked was that you don't embarrass me. We can't hide from this. The cameras go everywhere. It's up to us to hold these guys accountable. Just because some other paper used gossip as front page news, I mean, that doesn't mean we have it to. It does. It does now. He is a man with power, and that takes certain responsibility. We need to say something. It's nobody's business. None of it is. OK, but we're not talking about that. We're talking about how you get through today. This campaign is about the future, not rumors, not sleaze, and I care about the sanctity of this process, whether you do or do not. Go on, Gary. Say it. There's gonna be a story tomorrow about me. Foreign Correspondent of the Year, Marie Colton. Where did you get that eye patch? At Treasure Island. I need a photographer. Any good? The best. 
can't stop thinking about it. Unless you go crazy, it's not something you get used to. War is not so terrible for governments, for they are not wounded or killed like ordinary people. Our mission is to speak the truth to power. You're prepared to sink your country into civil war. What happened? They've opened fire on journalists. If the government catches you, they'll kill you. I have nightmares every night. You've seen more war than most soldiers. You have to take it seriously. I hate being in a war zone. But I also feel compelled to see it for myself. Because you're addicted to it. If you use the sat phone, those drones will know where we are. We don't have time! No one in their right mind would do what you do. She needs to get the hell out of there. We have to go back. We will die if we go back. I want people to know your story. You have a God-given talent for making people stop and care. Just being alive. Yeah! I see it. So you don't have to. If you lose your conviction, what hope do the rest of us have? Maybe I would have liked a more normal life. Maybe I just don't know how. told you you're kind of a weird guy. Yeah, but they're all dead now. I have to tell you something. It's about where I came from. Sure. If it's alright with you, I'll bring a table for two. This fancy restaurant.